I spent nearly 16 hours creating the worst ballpark ever seen in MLB The Show Stadium Creator. And yes, the elevation is as high as possible. Time for our first game at the L Center, this worst created stadium in MLB The Show facing John Smoltz. I think we had Logan Webb on the mound. This stadium is available on the vault. We can see the L right there. That's why they call it the L Center, E-L-L -L Center. As y'all can see right on the little scoreboard, it's time for one of the best games at one of the worst ballparks in MLB The Show history. One batter, Shaw Murphy. Come on, make the play. We got a diamond feeling catcher. And he's able to be safe on that strikeout. I don't know if that really makes too much sense. I don't think Shaw Murphy really has diamond fielding. I think that might just be a straight up lie. Oh, make the play, Gallo. It's going to get down. I got a perfect throw to second. If he goes, he's not going. Wait, he is going. Oh, okay. <laughs> I didn't think it would not tag him. Usually the game just locks me into a tag. I can't move until after the tag's been placed. I might just be the worst MLB The Show player of all time. I honestly don't think I can recover from these first few days. Also, if y'all could drop a like on the video, it always helps out. It really helps out more than you might think. It helps the videos get pushed and recommended, stuff like that. Feel free to subscribe if you enjoy MLB The Show videos. We're on the road to 100,000 subscribers. Comment down below if there's any stadiums in the vault that you want to see me use in a video. Like maybe your favorite content creator made a really cool stadium and you want to see me use it. Or maybe you just found a really cool stadium and you want to see me use it. Let me know if there's any of those down in that comment section. We're going to go ahead try to get out of this inning. Lindor able to make the play easy peasy. Lemon squeezy. On our way to the bottom of the first inning. 0-0 zero, zero here at the L Center. Trying to get some runs, man. It's max elevation. We're going to hit some home runs here. Lindor on top of it. Hit it kind of hard, though. For round number one. Stanton hit it hard. The first ground out was 106 miles an hour. I want to see this one. I feel like Stanton probably hit it a little bit harder, but I'm not sure. Okay, they're both 106 mile an hour. That's better. That might be gone, even with late timing. This ballpark's something special, man. No, it's literally warning check power. That's okay. I was late on it. After one, zero, zero. I still have a perfect game being thrown against me. Oh, that pitch is nastier than my grandma's toes, man. Does anyone else leave their pitchers in until they're out of energy, or is it just me? Oh, I thought we had the double play. Oh, and two, I got the ground ball. But the ground ball was not hit to one of my fielders. We have two on. One down, pinch hitter coming in. It's going to be a righty facing our lefty. I got to get that change away lower next time. I want to turn it, but my team is so slow sometimes. Yo, that's one of the fastest double plays I've ever seen him turn. Good job, y'all. Now I got to go hit. This is a max elevation ballpark. I'm hitting 533 with Machado. I will say, though, I've been playing a lot of road to the show. Yo, that's probably why my timing and my PCI placement's bad. It's because I've been doing the road to the show method. Oh, I'm stupid. That's a bad swing. No way. No way. The Grandy Man. Wow. <laughs> There's a reason that, we, that we're calling this the worst park here on, uh, here on MLB 22, man. That's it's a 339 foot bomb. From Curtis Granderson, just like that, we're three outs away from winning this ball game. Also, I don't know if I made it clear or not. We're playing the events. I wanted to be able to use this ballpark, and then I also wanted to try to get my 20 wins for the event. So I figure, hey, we can use the ballpark while playing the event. Joey Gallo's hitting 647, and we can also hopefully get the wins that we need. No, man. I'm really struggling. I really am starting to regret playing Road to the Show. Like, I'm glad I got my diamond ball player. I got some extra XP, a little bit of stubs, too. So, I'm happy for that. But I don't know if it was worth it. For I, I was hitting really, really well. I had so many guys, like, batting over 500 for me in the event. And now I just can't hit anything. I'm struggling to, to make some solid contact with solid timing at all. Oh, that's nasty. One and away from being 1-0 at the L Center. 
One out away from another win in the events. One hanging slider away from having this game be tied, though. I can't be making bad pitches. I got to get perfect pinpoint releases. And there's no way. There's just zero chance he expects three sliders in a row. Does anyone else leave their pitchers in until they're out of energy, or is uh, is uh, is that just me? And then I go and strike him out, man. I am so mad at myself for making that pitch, and I'm gonna continue to be mad at myself unless we could walk it off here. If we go to extra innings, I'm gonna be mad. So we really gotta focus up. I'm gonna lock in. We're gonna walk it off. Move on to the next game for y'all. There it is. Now we're early. Oh, get down, ball. Carry. Hey, it's not a home run, but it is a double. The go-ahead run is in scoring position. I'm going to try, I guess, Cedric Mullins, man. I was thinking Cody Bellinger or Spencer Torkelson, but we're going to go Cedric Mullins here. Oh, there it is. Gone. It, it might not be gone, but it's a walk-off. Cedric Mullins walks it off for us. We are two to winning 2-1. to one. Want to know in this video, let's go get another W here at this ballpark. It's time for the second game of the L Center. Let's see if we can start off undefeated, be 2-0, facing Zach Wheeler. I'm really hoping my hitting can just be better than last game. Maybe I've knocked the rust off a little bit. Donuts are fresh, open seven days a week. Let's try to get another dub. This game might be a long one on the mound for me. Come on, make the play, Manny. You got it. Let's go, dude. Oh, Manny to Manny. Manny would. I'm number two. Honestly, besides the home run, that wasn't really a bad inning. One pitch. No, 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 no. One diving play, one out for me. There we go. Stanton. Oh, hit the glove. Hit the glove. That's what my grandpa used to say. Hit the glove. Hit the glove. We didn't hit the glove, though. I went? No. Yo, this umpire's got to be blind. I wasn't even close to going. I, I, My hands were, like, sitting here like this. They were on the desk. I didn't have them on the controller. I don't know how. The umpire is trying to say that we won a round. Oh. Manny to Manny. Wait, a deja vu, bro. I feel like Da Vinci's happening to my brain right now. What's going on? That was weird. One pitch. One out. Two pitches. Two outs. Also, don't look at the scoreboard. Like, it says that it was 0-1, but that was the second pitch of the inning. I, I can I can guarantee it. Honestly, not a bad curveball, but I feel like that's also not a bad piece of hitting to just go ahead and beat the shift with it. Two down, one on. Actually, that's that's a good pitch, man. That's just... that's It's not a good piece of hitting. That's a good pitch, too. Uh, I'm going to take out John Smoltz. He's got Jim Edmonds and then a pinch hitter. Oh, Raldis Chapman might be the move. I feel like I'm not as good with him this year. That's my last lefty in the bullpen. I guess I could do Rob, Rob Dibble. You guys can't see. I'm going to turn off the cam. Uh, I'm not good with Rob Dibble. I don't know why. He's got an infinite ERA for me. That's how it is every year. For some reason, I am not good with Rob Dibble. Yeah, I also suck against Rob Dibble. I don't, I don't know if I've ever gotten the hit versus a Rob Dibble card. He's stealing. I guess it didn't matter. We struck him out. Going to try to take the lead and then have our opponent down to their final three ounce. Just like that uh, that last game where we ended up blowing the lead. Though We won the game, so that's really all that matters. The Grandy Man can. Honestly, that one felt pretty good. I, 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 would, say, I would say I'm happy with that one. Also, does like the apple go out of the thing if I hit a home run? Is it going to go up? It is. Look at that. Yo, the apple was going up. That's kind of cool. Sean Murphy. Still batting zero, man. The, I told y'all, fresh donuts are available seven days a week. And they're all coming from Sean Murphy. Still batting literally donuts across the board, batting zero. And Gallo's still hitting 6'11". Even though I didn't have a hit with him last game, man. I've, I've really got to step it up. I've done too good with this card to start the year to start doing this badly. 
No. Bounce overs. I thought he was about to just sink it into the ground. I thought maybe there was a patch of quicksand or something. That was strange. Oh, he hits him. Yo, that might have broke his toe. I rolled his Chapman coming in. I'm going to pinch hit for him. I want Cedric Mullins last game. I kind of want to try out Belly. I don't think I've really used him much. Apparently, maybe one for three or something. But I just wanted to get Belly in AB. I tried to check my swing right there. 100%, man. There's no way that that should have been a swing. I'm glad that's not a dot. One and one. Looking for a pitch to drive. Oh, there it is. I got under it. I just smashed the PCI down. That's the end of the inning. Let's go try not to blow this one. We were in this pretty much same situation. The last game winning by one. And I ended up blowing it. So I'm going to do... Uh, I don't think I'm going to go with Rob Dibble and his infinite ERA. I think we're going to go Goose Gossage. I've never used this card this year. Uh, I, I've had some decent success with Goose Gossage cards in the past. I'm hoping I could carry that over. Pinch hitter, which will probably be a lefty. Yeah, Ryan Howard, George Springer, Jay Cronenworth. It's going to be difficult, but I got confidence in my ability to pitch. I haven't really blown too many games often. Uh. We're tied 2-2. Two and that's not really what I wanted to have happen. But it is what happened. And now I got to deal with it. I, I, I need to try to fix the mistakes that I've made. And so far, it's kind of working out. If we could just get out of this inning with the game still tied. I, I kind of got faith. In the MLB gods that they're going to allow me to do what we did last game. But that's just only if I don't make another mistake pitch. That's only if we can get to the next inning. Still tied. Which we do. So. How does he hit the pitch down the middle. For the home run. But he can't hit the pitches that are right dotted up on the corners. He keeps getting jammed by those. But the pitch down the middle. He hits for a home run. Does that make sense to anybody? Also, Lindor, bro, I'm sucking with this card, man. I'm telling you, I, I I, played a little bit after I got my ball player to diamond last night just to try to find my swing. I didn't find my swing in a game or two. And then here we are today. Still haven't found my swing. Lindor's 0 for 1, about to be 0 for 2. We're facing Devin Williams, one of the best relievers currently in the game. And we're just sending that one to the outfield. I, I don't know who chose this ballpark. These walls suck. Like, this is one of the worst stadiums I've ever seen in MLB The Show. I I'm really not sure who decided to play here as Giancarlo Stanton walks it off for us. We win the game. 4-2. to 2-0 two. at the L Center. You love to see it. Uh, I think that's going to be it for this video. I hope you all enjoyed it. I had a good time today, man. I've actually been having a lot of fun with the... the, the but, but, whoa, 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 whoa. I have been having a lot of fun with the videos recently, so I hope y'all have been enjoying watching the videos. Stanton walks it off right there. Uh, you love to see it. Team's going crazy. I need to make some uniforms. The cameraman's filming their backsides. That doesn't really look like the best camera work, work if I'm going to be 100% honest. Watch it fly. Let's see if he does any like special bat flip for walking it off real quick. Nah, it doesn't really look like it. So I hope y'all enjoyed the video, though. Like, comment, subscribe, social medias. Again, comment section. Let me know if there's any other creative ballparks you want to see me doing. Uh, I'm probably going to make my own actual ballpark at some point. But for now, I'm just kind of having fun with what we've been doing. But I'll see you next time. Thank you guys for watching. I hope you have a great day. Peace out. Wait, watch this bat flip by Stanton. He's watching it. He's watching it. Then he just throws the bat. Look at this. Hey, he almost, look at that. Even Salvi's like, hey, he just threw the bat right by me.